Hey guys, if for another Emphatic Fury War recap, victory against Made in Myanmar, random war, uh, not completely even breakdown, as you can see we had one more Town Hall 11, um, some attacks left in the end of the war, we, we left some, some Town Hall 9s, uh, they left uh, 2 Town Hall um, 10s and 9 Town Hall 9s, kind of weird. They could have won this one, they did better than us on 10v11, uh, even on 10v10 they got one more, uh, but uh, we did okay, our 9s did better than them. We got one 11v11, uh, 11v10 nice uh, dipping, so yeah, this was it, I hope you, you like these uh, recaps that I just selected. Quick look at the in game stats uh, 28 to 31. On triples for us. Uh, and yeah, we'll start with Thresher with this uh, 10 v 11 2 stars. So he starts with uh, some wounds. Uh, hasted wounds to get the, the CC and uh, to take down the Archer Tower. And then Archer Queen starting at 1 o'clock, Baby Drag funneling at 11, uh, Archer Queen with a Rage, and then he drops the Poison, uh, he got a Witch kinda late, two Witches uh, kinda late to that party, so they got stuck there with the Baby Drag. Um, but then Baby Drag with the splash damage uh, ending up taking those switches finally. So it was okay. So Archer Queen walking towards 3. Meanwhile he drops some minions. Uh, 9 towards 6, all that fun with minions to get a free percentage. That activated the eagle. Uh, meanwhile, he sends VK at three with a couple of wizards behind. So Kiwi <sighs> VK under heavy fire. Uh, he was meant to put to funnel that side and get some more percentage, and then with a jump uh, towards the um, the compartment next to the town hall. Uh, bowlers will go for a nice walk. <laughs> so some of those uh, who came back with the heel uh, near the town hall. Archer Queen dealing with enemy Archer Queen, almost going down to the to the eagle, but with the ability he manages to get the the town hall, so he gets the two stars there. <laughs> kind of weird layout with all those expos uh, clumped up there in that compartment at far. But yeah, uh, Archer Queen getting a bit more percentage there, ending up on this 57. So a nice job for Thrasher. Next one is the 11v11 triple from Joe. Coming here with the quad quakes, opening the the compartment that leads to the town hall. A couple of uh, of baby drags funneling on both sides. And then uh, bowlers on each side. This is a hit. That looks pretty familiar. <laughs> so, which is joining the party with the bowlers? Uh, everything moving towards the base with the nice rages on that entry. Poison for the CC troops and the heal. Word and ability nicely used there. So when they came out, they are uh, 
just above the the town hall and the infernos and uh, the troops just smashing this space, lots of uh, witches and skellies. At this point, not many troops remaining, but uh, I should be using the ability there, clearing some more uh, trash trash buildings. But on the left side, uh, a group of four witches with tons of skellies, even some some ballers. Uh, Archer Queen under heavy fire goes down right now, but at this point, Warden takes out the uh, one cannon and uh, just one cannon up. Uh, so those skellies open the wall and take the cannon, and this base is wrecked. Great 11v11 here for Joe. Very nice one. And there it is. Next we have the um, the 10v10 triples. First one on base 16 with jumper. Jumper coming here with a uh, Lalo. He starts uh, with BK tanking and the wizard funneling at 1 o'clock, couple of wizards at 11 test wall breaker and then uh, some more wall breakers to open the wall at 12 archer queen behind uh, with the objective of getting into that uh, that compartment to get the uh, air defense he uses the BK ability, he takes out uh, and the archer queen and the AD and then uh, he just starts Lalo starting at 11, nice moon deployment there haste with the loons uh, moving quickly and uh, rage right there in the car with the heal waiting for the loons on the on the, uh, the wizard towers and then sending more more loons with a hound ahead another rage to deal with the second inferno everything moving nicely He used the, <laughs> the skelly there, so the DK goes down to the skellies. And with the amount of uh, looms remaining uh, and minions doing cleanings, the last defenses will stand no chance, even having a um, uh, corner troll Tesla at 3. Hound uh, just popping, but. Um, some minions will help taking those out as they get closer right there in the car and the remaining troops including loons doing the cleanings so nice triple here for jumper with the sui heroes lalo and the next one is on base 18 we have jjd Galileo Hopkins coming here with the Hawks Shattered Go Boho it's the adaptation of the JJD Town Hall 9 hit that he, he usually uh, use so Archer Queen uh, Suicide at 3 Shattered uh, Kill Squad going from 1 o'clock he opens the wall, will not use uh, any jump, just ballers and uh, DK. Archer Queen uh, cleared some nice defenses at 3. And then a nice rage, helping that kill squad, uh, destroying some of this base. You can see uh, poison for the loon. BK uh, got stuck on the wall at 11 <laughs> and then Ballers opened the wall uh, inside that compartment so he starts Hogs while BK is tanking uh, really nicely done heal right on that first um, Inferno uh, lots of Hogs from 7.30 on the tes those Teslas and uh, then 
with a couple of uh, skellies taking out uh, enemy archer queen that's the JJD touch great hit here for JJD and then very patient uh, using a, a heal on the last defenses and you will see a great uh, great poison for those pups so he took out those pups uh, with a great placement of that um, that poison at this point is just clean up time uh, amazing hit for JJD with this attack <coughs> it was a great plan for this space but really nicely done and the next one and the last uh, can be 10 is from Evil. Evil coming here with uh, lots of uh, of hugs. <laughs> he, he starts such a queen to seeking her minds, uh, just uh, getting out that uh, baby drag that was supposed to funnel at 2 o'clock. But Archer Queen Fundling at 5. So he just sends a CC Golem from 4 and uh, three, uh, 3 Wizards from 3 waiting that funnel. Then he opens the wall, sends BK and Bowers uh, to get into the base. Nice poison for the CC Loon and the enemy Archer Queen. Even with the <laughs> the wizards taking out the, the hound, unfortunately, <laughs> but yeah, he will deal with it. So hogs reinforcing uh, from eight o'clock. First heal down for the for the first group of hogs, big group there. As they move. Uh, Another nice, nice heal in the right place, considering those uh, giant bombs. And then he, he puts uh, a nice skelly for those, a nice skelly, a nice poison for those skellies. And that heal ends up saving the, the day. Just a couple of hogs on the bomb tower. And from now on, it's just cleanup. So nice, cold blood, go boho from Evil, suicide queen to funnel, and this was a really nice triple. Lots of hogs in the end of the raid, so very dominant. Hound ends up popping, but a bit late at that point. So with this one we only have uh, Town Hall 9 hits. Starting here with Madara. You will see not a very common attack. Archer Queen with healers starting a walk. You can see there is no wall breakers but there is two jumps. Pre-funneling at 6, first golem at 4 with wizards behind. So Archer Queen is moving up from 3 towards 12. Uh, 3 golems on the bottom of the base, and lots of wizards behind funneling. As they get the, the cannon, it will drop the first jump, leaving the 2 golems uh, to the core of the base with the VK and Volvers coming behind. Arch Queen using the ability and uh, funneling that right side for the, the main group. And then he drops the second jump leading to the back of this base. Uh, Golem and the wizard did a, a nice job on the left side because now uh, decay and bowlers uh, with some wizards coming 
to help Archer Queen ends up going down for the enemy BK but uh, with the amount of uh, troops uh, in the core and with the seven wizards that he had uh, in the back at this point he will end up uh, finishing this base the, those healers did a nice job they're holding the the Golemites while BK was coming for the rescue meanwhile wizards opened the wall to the outside but uh, Golemites uh, thanking for a nice wizard that takes out the expo just check that out <laughs> pretty awesome and then uh, BK uh, still had the ability we'll use it here in the end and then uh, six more wizards uh, to drop uh, so they can go for the last defenses uh, really really cool strategy here from Adara with all those wizards uh, getting it done really clutch uh, wizards there and the next one is 28 Lion King base Gake with the Queen Walk Hawks, Queen Charge Hawks. So he starts at 4 with a, a wizard funneling on the left side of the Asher Queen. Some minions at 3. Funneling, so looks like he wants Archer Queen to move towards the the bomb tower compartment at 4 he meanwhile he's cleaning some trash on the left side of the base with some minions and archers archer queen going towards the compartment that I said and then some wall breakers under rage opening that compartment poison for the enemy archer queen and also cc so it's a shared shared poison really nice and valuable charge because he gets uh, cc archer queen bomb tower and uh, will go ahead and even take the one one expo so really really valuable charge there another rage is investing a bit on this archer queen then a kiwi from 10 o'clock as you can see so he aims to get the uh, bk with the bk and then starting hogs with a giant tanking the entry at five o'clock uh, really nice touch uh, lots of hawks uh, going for that uh, expo that was heavily armed delaying uh, the first uh, heal for the Tesla farm but enemy BK already down some uh, hawks from the left really nice and then as Archer Queen is moving up and tanking for the hawks he just don't risk it uh, and sends the, the second heal so really nice nice hit here for Gatke even with uh, some troops including a nice wizard <laughs> for the swag as you can see but troops cleaning everywhere and uh, this was a really nice really nice triple from Gatke with the AQ charge hogs next one uh, Gaki again so we got a nice six pack and of course using the queen huh? queen charge hogs again <laughs> <coughs> so a couple of minions uh, funneling for the enemy so for the archer queen as the archer queen engages the enemy archer queen and uses the the ability the royal cloak right there a uh, nice couple of hogs uh, just to make sure that Archie Queen moves to the right 
Meanwhile, poison for the CC that was alert starts uh, a minion uh, to help funneling get three. BK and Wizard, so nice Kiwi tanking for the for the wall breakers, I guess. Nice test wall breaker, and then two more to end up with this uh, wall. Really impressive job. Two more uh, wall breakers to open the, the wall on the next compartment, allowing wizards to go in. Check it out. Amazing performance here from Gake. As Archer Queen gets close to the enemy BK, he has the help of some wizards. And then a nice rage. Uh, Depth into the base uh, to allow the Archer Queen to move and get uh, full of advantage of that uh, rage. Meanwhile, Sides Hogs from 5. Nice, uh, nice giant tanking for Hogs at 9 for the, the test of arm. Meanwhile, uh, troops with the first uh, heal moving everything towards uh, one o'clock big group of uh, <laughs> uh, there was a bacon maker there but uh, those hogs managed to survive and uh, Gake even swag the heal on this way and also with a with the poison in the packet. <coughs> so, amazing job for, for Gake with this uh, six pack. And we are almost done. So, we have uh, this as the last hit uh, Flying Serpent coming here with the Shattered Go Boho as he really likes to do. It's a very reliable strategy, so he uses uh, Wizards and Baby Drag to funnel one Valk uh, there with Kill Squad. This is just a go hole with that Valk to help the Kill Squad. So he will probably have uh, CC Hawks. So BK using the ability taking out the enemy Archer Queen. Nice shape on this base as the uh, Archer Queen goes in. He starts Hawks uh, with a giant tanking, distracting the, the Wizard Tower. That's really nice. Splash damage. And then reinforcing with Hawks on the Tesla outside the walls. <coughs> Hawks all together. Really strong, he can use uh, another heal there. And uh, he uses a poison for the skellies. And looks like uh, uh, heal swag. Because that bomb tower will not get those hogs. So, Archer Queen up with the ability. Troops to get the uh, corner huts. Really nice job. Archer Queen with the ability and the swag heal and also a couple of minions. So great job here for Serp ending up this war against Made in Myanmar with a nice heal swag. Uh, this was the the recap, I hope you have enjoyed it.